hi guys so we are gonna do a taste test of some alcoholic carbonated beverages um, we've got some chew highs and some highballs so we're gonna just get to it and start giving them a try yeah yeah <laughs> you don't sound very enthusiastic all right which one do you want to try first doesn't matter So this one is the umaboshi highball. So we'll give this one a try. Just tastes like a highball, watered down, no real flavor. Yeah, I don't know if I'm a fan of that. It's like very salty. Hmm. Fizzy. I poured a lot in my cup too. Yeah. I don't like this one. Not a fan. No. It tastes like a highball to me, so it's very fizzy. Highballs usually have some sort of like spritzer water or sparkling water mixed with something. Is high is a highball whiskey? Um, there are whiskey highballs. Oh. Cause I don't want to go to an easy kaya. I like the highball whiskey ginger with ginger ale in it. What do you think, Poggy? Sorry, I'm trying to catch up. Oh. How do you want to rank them? All right. I'm going to say that's a three. Out of five? <laughs> Out of ten. <laughs> I would say two. <laughs> All right. Two. Yeah. All right. Oh my God, we're going for another one. Okay, so a Chuhai Umaboshi, which is pickled plum. Hi. You want some cane? Yeah. Well, at least this one's pink. I mean, that other one was slightly pink. Was it? Trying to like empty the can. Yeah. Much better. This one actually has some flavor to it. You can yeah. taste the sour plum. You can smell it. This one I like. Yeah, you have to like the sour plum flavor. So if you don't like the the flavor of the sour plums, then this one is not for you. But mm -mm. I mean, I don't like sour plum ramen. I found that out the hard way. So I think if you're a fan, then you would like this. I like it. Uh, and it's much better than the other one. Yes. I bet, though, if you had mixed this one with that one, it'd be good. It'd make this one worse. <laughs> Maybe make that I one would, better. I just wouldn't buy the other one. Buy this one. <laughs> What's the alcohol on this one? 5%. I like it. I would say seven. I was thinking six, but seven, seven's okay. All right, next up. Let's go with this one. Melon. Melon zero, 9% alcohol. such hefty pores. <laughs> oh my god, it smells like a cantaloupe. Flavor-wise, 
flavor is pretty good in yeah. terms of melon. I don't know if I like melon as a flavor for my drink, but yeah, uh, it's kind of like the last one uh, where the, the flavor is pretty spot on for it. Yeah. Well, I mean, I like this one. It's got good flavor. What I don't like is the aftertaste of the zero. Like whatever they put in the aspartame or whatever, I'm, I can tell that it's diet and I don't like it. Now, when we, when we rank them, we're ranking them for how much we like it yeah. or enjoyability. Enjoy it, yeah. Okay. Would you want it again? Would you would you go somewhere and and order it, or would you pick it up at Family Mart? I mean, I could probably get used to it. I would. I, I said six for the other one. The other one was clearly better. So, I, I mean, like four. Um. Maybe four. if we didn't if we didn't have the zero. If it was normal, yeah, normal and didn't have the aftertaste, I'd I'd rank it the same as the last one. I just don't like the diet flavor. Maybe I should lower that one down. <laughs> well, we said what? Two for the first one, three yeah. for the first one? Well, we'll catch that on review of the video. <laughs> um, we might downgrade the other yeah. one. So that one can nestle pretty good. It's not, the flavor is good. It's it's the aftertaste. So if you like are a diet soda drinker, you'd probably be fine with that. I am not a diet soda. Uh, Oolong Chu Hai? Is that what that says? Saku. That's I think the name, the brand. No, yeah, we'll figure it out. All right. Nine percent. Let's not be so hefty on the pour. Yeah. Oh, it's it's soda. Cola. Yeah. Oh, Cora. <laughs> okay. So it's alcohol soda at 9%. I mean, I like it. I like it. actually tastes like Pepsi. Yeah, more Pepsi than Coca Cola. Yeah. I would say because it's got a little bit of the. So if you like Pepsi. You would love that. I mean, I'm a fan. I would definitely get this one again. I mean, I normally mix it myself, but if you don't want to mix it yourself, get this. Get the and, can. And it's like an eight. It's like yeah. eight. I mean, I'm not a soda drinker. I don't really like drinking soda, so I wouldn't order it, but I can drink it. I would buy this again. And the, and the fact that it tastes like a Pepsi. Uh, I'd say an eight. I want to say a nine, but I feel like a nine would be like, I would get it again. And I wouldn't go out of my way for it because I don't like soda. But I wouldn't be upset if somebody gave it to me. I'd be upset if you gave me one of those ones. Uh, I would not be upset with, uh, well, yeah, with the, the Unaboshi one. That one. That one was good. The melon one was only bad because of the aftertaste. Yeah. But this one actually tasted like soda, so I could get behind that. I would... I'm mm. still saying an eight. All right, I'll stick with an eight. Next up. <laughs> Sour lemon. It's salty sour oh. lemon. So it's a lemon sour, but it has like a little bit of salty taste to it. All right. That's why we have 
a normal lemon sour over here so we can kind of compare and see if it tastes any different. You know what Japan needs to have? Chew high tastings. Like in the States, you have wine tastings, you have Napa Valley. They need Chew High Valley. Chew High Valley. Yeah. Listen, it's a great idea. Why don't we start that here in Okinawa? That, there you go. That's our ticket into Okinawa. I'm gonna start a Chew High tasting parlor. You would have to have a work visa. <laughs> well, okay, wait, hold on. I feel like I need to try the base first. Okay. Tastes kind of like a warhead. Well, I mean, it's a lemon sour, so. Like the little lemon candies. All right, last one. It's just, I don't taste like the sour. Is it? Well, I mean, this is a different brand, so lemon sours from different brands have a little bit of a different taste to it. I would get this again. Um, I the, like it. The salt taste is very, very subtle. Yeah. So unless you were like a lemon sour fan, you probably wouldn't notice the salty aftertaste because it's like a very far aftertaste but as far as lemon sours I, I like this brand the best you had different lemon sours uh, yes and i i like this one the best but um as far as like taste i i think i actually like the cola one more no nope. but uh i mean i'll still give this an eight there's no tens today. If the salty taste was a little bit stronger, I'd probably say yes, because like you would get this and you drink it and you're like, wow, that's that's really salty. That's that's different. I, I'd give it a nine. A nine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean it's better than this one. <laughs> um, that's more of a sour sour. Yeah. Because it's very mellow and it's got a sour taste. It's just, it's nice. I would, I would order it. Like if we went out and I saw that on the menu, I would get it. All right. Well, we had that. Guess number one, because you, you gave it a nine, I gave it an eight. We both gave that one eights. Um, You're going the wrong way, babe. I know how cameras work. All right, so in order of ranking, this is what we have for these ones. Um, this isn't all of the different kinds that she got, so be prepared to compare videos. Yeah, and so I'm, I'll have a ranking system and I'll put you numbers. Put, a, put the numbers. Yeah, yeah, like <laughs> little little levels. <laughs> we'll do that in post. Yeah, <laughs> I need to learn how to do these things. <laughs> we'll call this part one. Yeah. Uh, the other parts might feature special guests, other than uh, trifecta and king. I do want to try this though. Do you want to try this? What is that? I'm going to try it. We already tried it. Oh, you're mixing that with the highball? Oh, you are totally downgrading it. I don't recommend this to viewers at home. We can just do a little bit, just a little bit, just a little. See? I mean, it it does improve the other one. So if you you got both of them and you're like, well, darn, I bought that one first. <laughs> Go out and get this one to improve the taste of that one. 
<laughs> That's an endorsement if I ever heard it. <laughs> well, shucks. I bought the wrong one. Guess Don't. I gotta mix them. Don't worry, it's salvageable. Just buy this other one and mix them together. Don't pour it down the sink. Just mix it. I mean, I think it works. Shoot, though. Did I... Dang it. Yeah, you might as well finish the can then. <sighs> Don't give it all to me. What are you doing? We're sharing. I can feel how much is left. This is a full thing. We'll finish this later. <laughs> Does it still, still taste good? I mean, it still has a smell. Yeah. Buy two of these and mix it with one. Yeah. At least, maybe three. <laughs> maybe just don't buy that one. <laughs> For the... For, for people who already bought that one. Buy three of these and mix them. <laughs> if we caught you too late, just go back to the store and buy three of those. Why not? Alrighty, well, until next time, I'll see you guys at the next taste testing. Maybe not me. <laughs>